Good morning, good afternoon everyone. My name is Mr. Tran and I am a teacher at Arthurville High School. I currently teach the Year 11 Advanced Mathematics course and I am here to give an overview of what's been happening in Term 1 and in Term 2. So in Term 1, we went straight into the topic of algebra because we thought it was important that students are able to develop their skills in algebra such as factorization, simplifying fractions, indices and thirds. Now these skills are essential throughout Year 11 and Year 12, so it was important that we were able to improve students' knowledge about it, but as well as be able to assess their current understanding. Now having gone through algebra in the next few weeks of Term 1, we then decided to move on to functions, in which students learnt how to graph uh, various types of functions, various types of uh, relationships that they can see. For instance, if students were given a table of values or were told a particular pattern, such as things are doubling and doubling and doubling, students must be able to recognize the type of graph that is formed when a particular object or amount keeps on doubling throughout a particular time period. Now that went up to about week eight or so of the term one. And so afterwards, we then moved on to the new topic of trigonometry. Now in trigonometry, that was worked from towards the end of term one through all the way to about week five, week six of term two. Now in trigonometry, students learned how to apply their skills to 3D trigonometric scenarios in which questions might have triangles of more than one or two. Um, students also learned how to do equations related to trigonometry. So instead of the basic soccer toa that they would have learned in stage five, students are now required to learn about the different identities involved with trigonometry and hence solve equations related to it. Now, in terms of the assessment tasks, our very first assessment task, which was held in Term 1, was an in-class test about algebra and about functions. Now, in Term 2, the assessment task will be about creating a stage in which students have to apply their trigonometric equation knowledge and their trigonometric identity knowledge in order to build a stage in a particular field, patch of land in Australia. Now, at the end of the assignment, which they need to hand in, students will be also given an opportunity to validate their understanding by doing a 20 minute in-class test. Now, as we continue through to term two, we will be going through calculus, an introduction to what differentiation is all about, what it means to the real world, and how students can improve their knowledge related to calculus. That leads us to term three, in which the students will be then doing their preliminary exam, which is sort of like a overview of the entire year 11 course um, and it's sort of like their final exam. Now I'm wishing every year 11 student good luck for their assessment tasks, their studies, hope that everybody's safe and well. Take care.